Hey guys, and welcome back to another video here on our channel, Kels and the Crew. Um, for anybody that's new here, my name is Kelsey, and in today's video, this is going to be a what's in my nursing bag video. So for anybody who doesn't know, um, I am a licensed practical nurse, I am a night nurse, and I've been an active nurse for almost a year. So in the beginning of February, that's when I actively started working as a nurse. So I want to go ahead and show you guys what's in my nursing bag. And this is the bag that I take with me every night. And y'all, I put a whole bunch of bull crap in it, I'm sure. And I haven't touched it or rearranged anything. So whatever you guys see is the real. Like, it's just, it's, I'm sure it's full of a bunch of bull crap. But I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what's in my nursing bag. Okay, so let's get started. So here is my nursing bag. Hold on. Let's start with the outside of the bag. So like I said, I'm a night nurse. So the bag says, sleep all day, nurse all night. And this is a really cute, really durable, strong bag, y'all, because I'm telling y'all it's heavy. Um, I got this bag from Amazon, and I think I paid like somewhere between $36 and $38 for it. But y'all, this bag has just with like it's just this bag is just super big and super strong and it's not breaking or ripping anytime soon and i have a bunch of crap in here so this is my bag now let's see what's in here okay so just hanging out is my um n95 mask these are the n95 masks that my job gives us and yes i work in facilities that do um, have patients with COVID. So we have to have the specialty mask. Okay, so I have a pair of goggles or glasses, the safety glasses. Um, have a pair of those just hanging around. I have an unfinished water bottle, y'all. This is dirty. <laughs> this is dirty. I have an unfinished water bottle. I'm going to throw it in the trash. This can also be a video of me cleaning out this nursing bag because this is a mess. I have a plastic bag. I don't know why I have a plastic bag, but I just have a plastic bag just hanging around. And then my blood pressure cuff um, to take vitals. This is what I use. I have I use my own stuff because nine times out of 10, unless you're working in a hospital, nine times out of 10, any nursing facility, like geriatric nursing facility that you work at, their vital machines are gonna be old and broken. So I bought my own. Um, I have a granola bar but you know what this was i need to put some more yeah i have a granola bar in my nursing bag but y'all these be coming in handy because when i'm doing them 12 hour shifts and i don't have time to eat just get one just get you one of them scrubs with the multiple pockets and stuff this from your bag into your cargo pants scrubs and you got yourself a snack while you're doing your med pass okay i also have an apple Y'all, I have an apple. I don't think it's rotten either. Did I just put this in here? I don't even, I, I don't even know. But I have an apple, one of them little quick snacks. Because if you are, a, like, if you, whatever facility you're working at, if it's a super busy facility, you won't have time to sit down and eat. Like, you just, you just won't. You just will not. So them little snacks, they be coming in handy. And then I also have, oh, it's all tangled. Y'all, this is, look at this. <laughs> Let me stop with myself. Why am I like this? Okay. So I have my stethoscope, my litty, 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 litment stethoscope that my fiance got me when um, I first started my, when I graduated school and I started my job, he bought this for me. So I got that. I have an unused mask just knotted up in my bag. So I have that. Some gloves. <laughs> I'm really a mess. I just got some. These are unused, y'all, of course. I have unused gloves just hanging out in my bag. Cuss, you'll never know when you need gloves, right? Um, I have a blood pressure cuff, a manual blood pressure cuff, just chillaxing in here. And it's all tangled. But yeah, I have that. That's good to have in your bag. So, so far, I have things that are needed. Nothing just. Nothing like crap, but like things that are needed. 
and then I have my little fanny pack that I put um, stuff in but I don't really use this I use this we got these in nursing school and you know like when you're a new nurse and you're just so excited for your first day in nursing uh, working as a nurse and you want to just have everything it's kind of like on your first day of school and you lay out everything um, for the first day so you could be looking fly and you've got your new shoes and your new uniform or your new clothes Yo, that's how I was the first day, the first day at work. So I had my fanny pack ready to go. I had my blood pressure cuff in here. I had my stethoscope around my neck. Yo, I had my pins lined up, my sharpies lined up. You couldn't tell me nothing on the first day. And I'm sure when I walked into work, they was looking at me like, look at her. She don't even know what she's about to get herself into. And y'all, they was right, because I don't even use this. So I'm gonna put that to the side. Um, what is this? Oh, this is this is my horoscope y'all why is this on my nursing bag but oh yeah because when i was at work my co-worker he's like really into horoscopes he like printed out my horoscope and we were just like reading it at work randomly so that's gonna be taken out um this might be tmi but we're grown right so i just have some pads in here because don't 12 hour shift you need some extra support so i put extra extra like feminine products in my bag so i'm sure i have some more i have my pull socks my cute little pull socks so i have that that's important and i need to stop with these dirty water bottles like i got another little mostly drunken water bottle in here that's gonna be in the trash um i have the benefits from my job here that's trash um what else do i have oh i have my id i don't want to show you guys where i work so i have my id here <laughs> why is it all over the place though all right and i have my thermometer my infrared thermometer so this is like i said i have my own vital stuff because their stuff is always broken so i just bought a whole bunch of my own i have an extra set of goggles or glasses face glasses so I have another set of those. Um, oh, this this is better. This is not drunk, drinking, drunk, drinking, drink. This is not this is not used. Okay, this is not used. So this is a regular bottle of water. I can keep that in there. Um, I have my sharpie. I actually need to get more of these. These are really important when you're a nurse, doing like dressings and stuff. You could just write on with your sharpie. So. That's good. Um, what else do I have? More gloves, cause you can't ever have enough of gloves, right? More gloves. <laughs> I am so horrible. More gloves. And they're all clean, y'all, I promise. Um, some more feminine products. So I have like some more feminine products because I'm telling y'all, if you get stuck at work, it's important to have these. So I have those. I just have like junk. Oh my gosh, these are like random papers, just like with, oh, I need this. This is my login for AccuLabs, so I need that. But um, just like random papers. Sometimes I write notes to myself, like, because if you're a nurse, you already know what I'm talking about, but like, if, you were, if you're like busy and you wanna remember something, like I always have like a little paper on me, Cause my job has like little trash paper like little scrap paper you can like just pick up and use so like if you're busy and you got everything coming to you at once and you're trying to do your med pass and this patient is here and this patient's here and this patient's falling and i like to write things and keep it on my cart just so that i can remember because y'all after nursing school my memory is shot y'all i i used my brain so hard at nursing school that now it's just so hard for me to remember stuff so i just um use those little scrap papers and I um, just write notes on patients or things that I need to do or things that I don't want to forget. And I usually put it in the um, vault or the what's it called? paper shredder, but those I didn't. So I'm going to take those away and put them in the paper shredder. Um, vitals from Lord knows what night that I work. These are vitals for the patients. I have more masks. Honestly, y'all, this one looks used. That's a little dirty. Yeah. This one is unused that I have. Or maybe it's... Y'all don't think I'm dirty. That one might be used to. I'm horrible. I have some more um, 
gloves. I promise the gloves aren't used. I have some trash, some snacks, trash. Trash bag of hauls from when I was sick and working. Um, yeah, so that's trash. I have, what is this? Oh, this is another N95 mask that I got for my job. At least this one's in a baggie. Um, so this is another mask that I have. I'm gonna keep that. Oh, y'all, I have another one too. I have a third one. How blessed am I? I have three of them. I have some hand sanitizer that's empty, so I need some, I need a new one, but yeah, this is empty, so this is no good use to me. I have a regular mask, which I shouldn't take to work with me. Um, what else? And y'all, I'm just, I got all the shades. I got another pair of goggles or face glasses. So I have three pair all together. Um, I have a watch. And I bought this watch from Walmart because I bought this watch, y'all, to count respirations. Let me go ahead and say, I don't want to get myself in trouble, but because I don't know if anybody that I work with watches my videos, but ain't nobody counting on respirations, okay? Ain't nobody counting respirations. If you don't have COPD or if you don't have some type of breathing problem or some type of acute distress is going on, I ain't counting your respirations. If you look like you're breathing normal and you look like you're breathing unlabored and you're fine and there's nothing I'm hearing or seeing that's, you know, of concern, girl, boy, your respirations is 18 to 20, okay? That's what your respirations is. So when I was a hype nurse or like a new nurse, my first day I went out and bought just like random stuff that I just knew I was going to use. So this is being one of them to count respirations that I don't really count unless I have a patient that I know I need to count respirations for. Any nurses can relate. Nobody count no respirations. I ain't got time for that. So this is another mask, but this was at the bottom of my bag, y'all. Look how dirty that is. I don't know if y'all can see how dirty that is. Maybe I should. Uh, look how dirty that is. That's dirty. So that's going in the trash. Um, I have a scrunchie just because I used to have like braids and stuff. I used to have braids or I used to straighten my hair. And um, when I'm like on the floor and I'm busy, I used to just pull my hair up. With these, I don't really have to pull these up. I usually wear like a headband with my little starter locks. But um, I can keep this in here because, I mean, if I don't have the headband, I can use this to kind of put this on my face if I'm doing something. I have some alcohol prep wipes so these are the alcohol wipes <laughs> and y'all just be taking them for my job i don't even need them but if you know like if it's in your scrub pocket and you clean out your scrub pocket i just throw them in my nursing bag but i don't use them um another set of vitals that should have been shredded i have some pens it's supposed to be black pens but this is blue but I have pens. I need to get. I need to re my pens because one things that nurse. One thing that nurses steal is pens. Like they be taking all your pens. They be like, "Can I use your pen real quick?" You give it to them, and you don't see that pen for the rest of the day. So, pens is definitely a hot commodity in the nursing world. <laughs> Yo, I got somebody's albuterol treatment. <laughs> Why do I have this? I got somebody's breathing treatment in my bag. I, in my, I must have had it in my scrub pocket. Like, I must have like kind of like prepared for the night because that's the only thing I could think I would do. I kind of prepared for the night and I put vials in my um, thing if they were like on a scheduled nebulizer treatment. And I must have forgot it in my scrub pocket and put it in my bag. So I have somebody's albuterol treatment. I have wrappers of food gummy bears wrappers of hauls oh dropped it's an actual hauls i told you guys i was sick so i just was chewing on hauls while i was working i have enough i feel bad because people pay for this so i have another albuterol treatment in my bag y'all this is horrible so i have another vial so that was i'm sure that was in my nursing pocket um I have more gloves because you just can't have enough. 
um, receipts from Joann's. I don't know why that's in my nesting bags, but maybe I went to Joann's after work or something. And some more hauls and wrappers and another receipt for gas. Just chilling in there. And this is my little, um, what is this? Oh, the little sleeve for my thermometer. So I gotta put that back in there. And then this, I, this is like a, a coupon or something for my job. Like you get $2 off or something that you wanna eat at the cafe. Yeah, $2. That's, that's, what, that's what that is. And then I have another blue pen, which I really need black pens. I can't write with blue pens. And then I have some messed up gauze like for treatments and stuff and cleaning off stuff. And then I have like this random coffee stir. I don't, I don't even know why that's in there. I have a highlighter because yeah, we use these in like the NARC book and stuff. So I have a highlighter. And then I have a raffle ticket. Probably entered a raffle at one of my jobs. And let me see. So that's all that's in here. Just crumbs and stuff in there. And then in here I have another two dollar coupon off of something I want in the cafe. Y'all, I have a I have a knife. What am I doing? Oh, because you know what? I brought a mango to work one day and um I wanted to cut it. So <laughs> I just got this little butter knife. I'm crazy. My fourth pair of goggles, and I swear, every time I go to work, I'm like, oh my God, I can't find my goggles. And I'll be looking at my bag, and they just be like, here, just take a new pair. So I have like four pair of goggles. That's crazy. What else do I got? Ew, this is probably so rotten. I got some Ritz crackers. Yo, I got random snacks and random parts in my bag, because I be so scared that these are old. I'd be so scared that um, I'm going to be so hungry and I have nothing to eat. Especially while working, like while, while you're running and just, I'm, I'm scared I'm going to be hungry. So I'll, I'll be putting random snacks. I got a black pen, which I need that. And then I have this little badge. So I have a shirt that says, um, nah, I'm the nurse. So I have, the, it came with this pen that says, nah, I'm the nurse, Mary Mahoney. Um, 1879 I think she was one of the first black nurses so I usually keep this on my bag but it kept opening and poking me so I just put it in the pocket but yeah I believe that is um what else oh this is my badge from another job oh yeah let me see if I can hide the place so this is my badge <laughs> I look a lot different in this picture because I'm gonna tell you about my come up story. Um, I used to be a CNA. So I was a CNA for six years, six and a half years before I went to nursing school and became a nurse. So I used to be with this job. Remember I told you guys in the um, uh, struggles of a nurse interview or video, sorry, video that I used to be a CNA at this job and then I became a nurse there. So this is a job. So I look a lot different in this picture, let me try to show you guys. Let me cover up the place I work. But <laughs> this is what I look like. I was super smaller, but my face always, my face, even if I was to lose like a bunch of weight, my face is like a natural fat face. So I have like really big cheeks, like high cheekbones. And like when I smile, I was like, you know, like super big. So even, Y'all look so small in this picture. Oh my god. Yeah. Even if I was small, like even if I was to be smaller, I would still have a big face. So that is all that is in my nursing bag. Um, I don't think it was super bad. It wasn't super bad. Just like the the old food and the old water was a little dirty, but um, it wasn't super bad. So um, thank you guys for watching this video. I'm sure if you are a nurse too, you can relate to just bullcrap being in your bag but if you guys like this video go ahead and like this video comment down below and don't forget to subscribe make sure you hit the bell to get notified every time we post a new video all right guys thank you for watching bye